Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we will be going over 15 shocking truths about Roman feasting habits. But before we start make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. And without further ado let's jump right into it. Number 1. Vomitoriums were a myth. There were no special rooms for vomiting. Some wealthy Romans, though, would induce vomiting to continue feasting. Number 2. Exotic and unusual foods. Wealthy Romans dined on unusual delicacies like stuffed dormice, flamingo tongues, and peacock as a status symbol. Number 3. Reclining to eat. Roman elites ate while reclining on couches, a luxury reserved for the upper class. Number 4. Feasts could last hours. Roman banquets stretched for hours, sometimes from late afternoon until late at night, with many courses. Number 5. Banquets were social events. Feasting was not just about food, it was a way to show off wealth, political power, and social status. Number 6. Wine was watered down. Romans never drank pure wine. It was mixed with water to avoid being considered barbaric. Number 7. Garum was a staple. Garum, a fermented fish sauce, was a common and beloved condiment, used to flavor many dishes. Number 8. Honey was the sweetener. Since sugar was unknown to the Romans, they used honey to sweeten their food and desserts. Number 9. Gluttony was common among the wealthy. Roman elites often indulged in overeating during feasts, symbolizing their wealth and status. Number 10. Multiple courses. A typical Roman feast had multiple courses, often starting with appetizers, gustatio, followed by the main course, prima mensa, and ending with desserts, secunda mensa. Number 11. Slave powered feasts. Roman banquets were run by slaves who prepared and served food, cleaned up, and even entertained guests. Number 12. Dinner invitations were political. Invitations to banquets were often extended to win political favor or influence others. Number 13. Entertainers at banquets. Musicians, dancers, acrobats, and sometimes gladiators performed during banquets for the amusement of the guests. Number 14. Imported delicacies. Wealthy Romans imported foods like spices, dates, and other luxuries from far-off lands like India and Egypt. Number 15. Lavish displays of food. Food was often displayed in extravagant and artistic ways to impress guests, sometimes more for show than for eating. And that's it for today. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. See you next time.